channel. Today we will see one real time project on customer churn analysis. So this is the most important domain in analytics domain we can say. In this video I will explain about domain knowledge also. I will explain how to do this analysis and how we get the requirement from the stakeholders. Okay, so let's see the data first. So this is the data I have. So in this data, I have customer ID, gender, senior citizens present in like uh, as per their age, they are young or old. Okay, then I have this partner column here. I am getting this uh, is that customers are partner with us or not? Dependence, tenure, phone service, multiple lines, internal service like fabric optic dsl internet service online security online backup device protection are there or not tech support streaming tv streaming movies contract paperless billing method payment method monthly charges total charges churn or not tenure one and customer url okay so we have all this data present and the customer's requirement is like so they have to find out the who all customers are uh, like doing the business with them and what all customers they are going out of that business okay so they have to analyze the count of customer profile and churn profile okay so churn profile i'm showing it in red and customer profile i'm showing it in blue okay so this is the dashboard that i have created and i will explain how to create all these dashboards and how to get the insights from this data okay so we have this table present and now we have to get the understanding of this dashboard okay so we'll see the customer profile first so in this customer profile we are showing the custom count of total customers total average charges and monthly average charges okay so count of customers is 1089 and total average charges is 2.30k and monthly average charges is 66.43 okay so this is for the current customers count and this is the churn that that is out of our business okay so we can compare these two okay so here in customer profile there are 1089 customers and from that 1089 to 88 customers have churn okay this total average charge is 2.30k in customer profile and here it's 1.46k monthly average charges is 66.43 and here it is 75.48 so this is more than this okay then demographic and demographic i'm showing this count of male and female okay so in the customer profile there is we can say the female count is less than male male count is more and in the churn profile here uh, female count is more than the male count okay then this in this tenure here we we have this all these tenures categories present and as per the tenures we are showing this count of tenure okay so this is in 0 to 20 there are many customers you can see and in this also we have 0 to 20 more and this citizens we can say uh, here in this customer profile we have the young citizen more than this old citizens and here also we have the same but some values values are varying okay so this is about citizens this is about contract so here we have this one year two year and month month to month contract okay so in these three categories we have higher count for the month to month contract and in this contract for joint profiles we have the month to month contract more than all other and uh, two year contract is so less so okay so we can say month to month was so if we are giving the contract month to month to the customers they are living more okay we can see that from this analysis 
here we have the internet services more for the fiber optic and then in dsl and then no uh, so there are no internet service this is the count of that okay so in the churn profile internet service here also we have the uh, fiber optic internet service is more so count of dsl also more so we can say from this internet service so wherever there is no internet service so people will not come from that side okay so they are going we can say where there is no fiber optic they are also in churn profile and this is the payment method so here also we have all these payment methods electronic check bank transfer credit card and mail check okay so here we can see in this chart we will getting this electronic check count is more than others in the customer profile in the churn profile also we are getting this electric electronic check count is more than others so we can say wherever there is electronic check they are also going so from this dashboard we, we can take the insights like for which reason people are going and we can give the recommendation to the stakeholders like for this this region the people are leaving more then they can do something okay so this is all about this video and here we have get the understanding of customer churn analysis okay and all about this domain and what is the requirement we get from stakeholder okay so if you like my video please press like button and do share it with your friends and family and don't miss to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you can receive the notification of my upcoming videos on real time projects power bi for beginners and the power bi use cases okay so till then take care bye bye Thank you so much for watching this video.